in here. What is good, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Nolito. Uh, today's video, let me lock you guys in here. So today's video, we're headed to the mall. So I'm gonna show you guys how to take your normal fitted and customize it the way you want. I wasn't really feeling the fonts that Lids provided. I was like, you know what? I'm gonna go pick one up and we're gonna customize it. So once we get to the mall, I'll show you guys the hats that they have. You know, I'll pick one out and we'll come back here and get started. So I'll catch you guys then. All right, so this is the one I'm looking at. That was a pretty good selection. I wanna get this one, but they don't have my size. Baby blue brand. I think I want this one. Michaels, there we're gonna find either the vinyl that we need for you know to iron on to the hat. I'm thinking we're gonna do something with the back of it, probably do like none above, but like really cool lettering, something like that. Or we can find some really cool patches at Hobby Lobby. So I'm gonna check both of them out and see what they have. So, uh, yeah, let's go. All right, you guys, so we're here at Michaels, and basically, you just want to find iron on, so that's what we're looking for. Yeah, holographic, glitter, different color, just pick up whichever color you need, and then you're good to go. So hopefully this video kind of answered that. As you guys see, I'm cutting out my stencils myself. I use a Silhouette Cameo. You guys could use a Cricut or one of those circuit cutters or whatever. Pretty sure they're the same thing. I really don't know the difference. I've just always used my Silhouette Cameo and it's never failed me. So we're just gonna jump right back into the video. Well, I'm not so strong bet. Whole team winning, yeah, we all set. And we ain't really in it that if you ain't on that. Once you give me the same love, I give it all back. It be the ones you don't expect to have it down for you. Even when I was down bad, I was down for you. Even if I ain't have it, bro, you had it too. I don't be feeling like that vibe is compatible. Okay, make no mistakes, now them boys don't mess around. Yeah, I'm flawless, I'm great. You should come and check me out. I'ma do what it take, long as they don't take me out. All right, so here's a perfect example of me messing up. Now, a lot of your other YouTubers won't show this part of customizing or anything like that you know what I'm saying but this is perfect you know I I, I could have just left this out but I was like you know what I want to be very like open with you guys I want you guys to see that I mess up too it's a learning process and I was still able to come out and make a fire custom hat you know what I'm saying so don't be afraid to make mistakes it's all about learning hopefully you guys learn from me you know what I'm saying uh, right here I'm just kind of just taking acetone and removing the lettering uh, it did leave some residue which is fine because I just pretty much just ironed over the residue so you can't really see anything um, but yeah just wanted to come on and you know quickly show you guys that I mess up too you know it's, it's cool you know it's all it's a part of being human we all mess up he gonna need advice if you still around you still by me and you did me right and I told him that's a strong bet whole team winning yeah we all set As you guys seen i definitely struggled with this hat i definitely had some problems but that's a part of being an artist it's about learning from your mistakes i could have just gave up and was like you know what let me scrap this idea you know what i'm saying at the end of the day i definitely made myself something that i'm definitely gonna be wearing a lot more um so yeah if you, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video my biggest takeaways from this project to anybody out there that wants to do this is one know your vinyl know what temperature what setting it should be set on and then how long it should be pressed you know what i'm saying i didn't pay attention to any of that that's why i had problems that's why i ended up burning some of the vinyl so know your vinyl know if it should be peeled on hot or if you should let it cool off but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys want to see me do another custom hat like tutorial uh, if you guys want to see me do some iron on patches let me know down below in the comments i'll catch you guys on the next one i hope you guys enjoyed it uh, make sure you guys leave a like, comment, and of course subscribe if you guys are new. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. This has been your boy Nolita. I'm out here. Peace.